I would never in a million years thought they would close it. Well, I mean, the Mindbender is iconic, to say the least. When I was very young, all my friends would ride the Mindbender, and I was afraid I would not get on it. When I became, uh, I guess, a uh, preteen or into my young teens, I rode it for the first time and I was hooked. I was mad at myself for not riding it more when I was younger, so. And now I'll never get to ride it again, <laughs> which is very sad. That first drop on the Mindbender, you, you go up to the very top and you, you kind of just travel for a few feet and then you're just looking down and it is a drop from the very top of that ceiling all the way to the bottom. That was the joy of the Mindbender. You felt beat up after. Yeah, Mindbender would, would take you and shake you around and it wouldn't apologize and you'd get back in line and do it again. They built that part of the mall around the Mindbender and, and people would come. Coaster enthusiasts would travel to, my, to, to Edmonton to go on the Mindbender, but that's how iconic the Mindbender was. Everyone wanted to shoot it, everyone wanted to ride it. Did they though? I mean, I know this is a deeply unpopular thing to say, but um, never, never been on a roller coaster. I can't do it. I'm, I'm a chicken. I'm a complete chicken, but I know people are going to miss it. The company says there's going to be something out of this world in its place. But yeah, I, I won't go there.